everybody. Good morning, ladies. Beautiful morning this morning. It's going to be another day. great day. It's not as cold as yesterday. No frost today, so quite nice. Cows are ready to go, ready to look. I've already started the machines because might as well start them. It's right there. And they'll all push in really well. I won't be able to get past it, so. All good. Let's get in the paddock and get these girls in. There we go, Milky's going well this morning, buddy, Dad. Morning. Oh, very bright today you are. Oh, yeah. <laughs> oh, good. Perfect. So I use you guys this time of year for about a month. Straight down the pit. Right in the mine. There you go. Morning. This has just collected her milk. Milk to shrunk some cows that we've caught for her. All good. Right. Keep cupping away. Good girls. Go, girls, up here. Come on. On to the last row now, and Dad said we're starting to run out of meal. Little feed is taking a little while to fill up. So, lucky he did order that on Monday, the next load. We'll be ready to be for, should be sometime today. Hey, meal, ready to go down. We'll go see little carvies down the back. Have I got my driver today? Yes. Ready to drive, Dallas? <laughs> yes, eh? Yeah, well, let's see how much water there is out here today. Oh, it's gone down a bit. I think we can make it. We can make it. Hopefully we can. Yay! We can make it to the end. We got there. Yeah, water's gone down a little bit. I thought it would have yeah. gone up again. Yeah. Reloaded. <laughs> yeah. Shifting dry cows or the milk of carving cows. Ah, oh, yeah. A couple of close ones is here. She's probably one of the closest, followed by that little jersey there. Although some of them are all bagging up. They'll be in the next week or two. <laughs> he thought he broke it. <laughs> yeah, look at him. He's like, I'll just leave that alone. It is for a drive. Whoopsies, you gotta look where you're going. What oh, good girl? And and this one here. Put that one down. Yep, that's it. Good girl. We're all ready. Yeah, squirt some poo out of it. You wanna spin it round for grandma? Give it a push. Grand is just putting this one down to throat because he uh, is not drinking really well at the moment. So feed him down the throat. 
it should come right over the next couple of days. Garvey's looking happy. You got these ones here getting their hay. Got a bit of meal there, same with these fellas, hay and meal. Same with those fellas, hay and meal. They'll be happy. Happy little coffees. All right, we're just gonna go around and spray some drains now. We'll start her up. Easy peasy, every time. So we're aiming for Poquanica. Nothing else, we don't want to hit the bank on the other side. Dad's already said there's areas where the bank's starting to collapse a bit. That's now what we're aiming for down there, Poquanica. So yeah, in this tank is a mixture of glyphosate at one litre per 100 litres. And then there's also 30 grams of associate, which is pitch of sulfurin which is, um, kills for about six months, most grass types, most weeds, and uh, yeah, it works really well for us, and then also a nice associate, it does the job, uh, just an associate, sorry, a pulse penetrant, just to penetrate, helps to penetrate the leaf, and does a better job, quick kill job, that's why I sprayed that uh, down the driveway there, sprayed that, I was about four days ago now, and it's already going, killing off pretty well. Weeds growing around the base of that uh, flip tank, as you can see. I'm just going to spray all that, uh, make it look nicer. There you go, we've sprayed around our little flip tank here. Make sure we've got all of it, because if you don't get all of it, there's a possibility that the little spots that I've missed the grass will grow in those areas. But I've got it all. Amazing how quick it's drying with this beautiful weather. Cracker of a day. Well, we'll go down and spray some dry. Really in the video, why? If I spray the drain, the bank will collapse. It's because there's vegetation growing on the bank. It's stabilizing that bank. So if you were to spray that vegetation, it's gonna die. And along with the root system that's holding that bank up, and it will um, make the bank slide in with any decent rain. So that's why we uh, don't wanna spray the bank. We'll get that slippage, and then we will end up losing a fence into the drain. Or worse, cattle will be standing on that edge eating the grass and then slide into the drain. And the drain between us and our neighbour is a good deep drain. Um, it's not a place where <laughs> I'd want to go into if I couldn't swim. So I can swim. Little toot over there, she's waiting to be reloaded. I've got to uh, put some more spray in her. We'll go down here, through that gate, over to our pig pen, and that's where we got our little hose that we fill her up with. Here we are, just added more of our little brew. Some left over in there. And uh, yeah, so we'll go down and fill her up in the pig pen now, and let's go spray some drain, Darren. You might have to run, buddy. There's not much space for you on this girl. Yeah, this is our area here that we fill up our spray tank. We're right up beside our old pig pen that we no longer use. Is that years ago? It's got an agitator in it, it goes up through the bottom pump, and instead of sending it up into the uh, hand sprayer or through our boom here. It goes out this pipe at the top here, which will um, put chuck it back down in and just mix her up. I was not expecting that to go that way. <laughs> right, that'll do it. Let's go spray some drains. Let's go, a little tank. You couldn't see it on camera, but it is going through. It is trickling out of that pipe there, so it's circulating in the system. Here we are, we've been sprayed. I've just sprayed all that Poquatica there. It's trying to grow and take over the drain. Let's keep our drains clear for any flood that could come. And here's our neighbour's herd next door here. Beautiful Jersey crossbreed herd. He was a pedigree Jersey herd not too many years back, but 
he has switched over slowly. I think we'll call it a day there. We didn't have to spray too much. There's not much vegetation growing in the drains at the moment. Fuck the way happy he has. Right, well, let's see, is that milking tonight? There we go. Yes, our mail truck's just arrived. He's gonna go and unload. Awesome. Watching Tessa feed some carvies. Get to work, Tessa, get to work. <laughs> that was a terrible throw. <laughs> I would have thought it. Oh, I think there should be enough cows in here to start milking. Just enough. Spinning away perfectly. Awesome. Good job. We'll go lock the cows away. Oh, yeah. Trough down a little bit, but that's alright. Still good. Looking good there, ladies. Everyone's happy. We've got lots of grass. A lot of dock in this paddock. This is uh, probably going to be a crop paddock either this year or next, either this season or next season. So, yeah. We hit really hard by these droughts. It was a young grass with the first drought, and then the last two droughts in a row didn't help. come down the farm today <laughs> good little dog and look at that willow trees are getting their leaves on them now <laughs>